Hi everybody, Deb Connor, Southern Indiana Rescue Effort. And, and I want you to meet a gorgeous boxer mix. This is Buck. Buck is less than a year old, but right at a year old. He, he only misses maybe another week or so being, being a year old, which means he's just an older puppy. And Buck is tickled because he's outside of his kennel right now for probably the first time forever. And, he, and there's a, another dog, a little bitty dog in the exercise yard, and he's happy. He's one of the friend. Buck is, Buck was picked up by the animal control officer staff from Davis County Animal Control in Owensboro as a stray. He was wandering around, which he's been well socialized. This, again, this boy's just a little puppy. Um, Deb, can you remember how much he weighs? No, but he's tiny. He's very, very tiny. While I'm doing this video, folks, I'm gonna be looking at his papers. This is a great dog. He's very, very loving. He's very gentle. And, and as with most puppies, he can be a little mouthy, but he's especially mouthy in the kennel. Once you get him outside, his behavior changes 100%. Buck is only 28 pounds. He's a gorgeous, friendly, happy little boy. And you know what, folks? He's been at the Davis County Animal Control for since, uh, yeah, October the 16th, 2019. So you know what? He's due a home. He's due a home. He's due, he's wanting to get out. He's heartworm negative. Good temperament. He's a good boy. He's a great boy. He likes this little ball. Let me see what the, we can do with the ball. Look at him. He's playing. He's a play bunny. He's a little play bunny. I'm going to get the ball. I'm going to get the ball for this beautiful baby. Look at this. Look at this, folks. This dog is great. He, If he wanted to mouth me, he could. He doesn't. He's uh, the, Sometimes the behavior of certain dogs inside the kennel is 100% different when you get them out. Because he's happy. He's happy probably for the first time in since he's Too been much. here. <laughs> yeah, Deb, since he's been here, especially since he's been here. Um, again, this guy is Buck. He's less than a year old. He is a boxer mix, and he's very, very happy to be outside his kennel, folks. You know what? Been here since October the 16th. He's heartworm negative. This is a boy that you want to take home for your kids. And the only reason he's being as active as he is today is because he just now got out of his kennel. We've had this dog out maybe 10 minutes and long enough to get him out of his kennel and walk him here. Deb, do you have anything you'd like to add about this beautiful little dog? He's only 28 pounds. He deserves better than what he's got right now. Sure he does. Look at him, folks. He's happy. Does your kid want a companion? Somebody to throw balls for this dog and the dog will retrieve him? I'm not saying the, not saying a buck will actually give you the dog's, the balls back, but hey, what the heck do I know, right? He's happy. Look at him, folks. The happy little boy. He's happy. The longer we have little Buck out, the calmer he's going to get. He's already calmed down sufficiently. Honey, it's okay. Got that leash on his neck. He's kind of kind of getting a little bit choked. But you know what, folks? This dog is on his last leg. This pet finder posting is Buck's last chance to re really get a good family. He's had no interest while he's been at the Davis County Animal Control. Why, I don't understand. He's obviously been well socialized, and he's happy, and he loves people. You know, why these people abandon their dogs is just a damn mystery to me. And actually, if I knew why, I'd probably be more like them. So I definitely don't want to be like these, these people that abandon their dogs. He's a good boy. Honey, we're going to try to get you out of here. We are going to try to get you out of here, little baby man. See, he's a puppy. This is a puppy, folks. Little baby puppy dog. He's beautiful. Okay. Buck. <laughs> Sorry, baby. Buck, we're going to do our best. It's starting to sleep, folks, in Owensboro, Kentucky. This is Saturday. Uh, we are, are due on Sunday, and today is supposed to start a wintry mix. So, the game. He's happy. He's a happy baby dog. He's a happy baby dog. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Folks, please give this dog a chance at being a companion animal for your family or your individual. You know what? He's a good boy. He is definitely a good boy, and he deserves a home. You know what? It breaks my heart to see these dogs knowing that probably he's going. His, his life clock is ticking. He's been here since October 16th, 2019. Buck could go down within a week. Look at him. Or he could go down within two weeks. But he's definitely going to go down. He's going to be put to sleep if somebody does not speak up for this dog. Be, the, be this animal's advocate. He's happy. You know, death is final. 
and I don't even want to go there. It hurts my feelings. Of course, it just hurts my feelings, but this beautiful boy will be dead. And don't go saying it's the staff's fault. It has nothing to do with the staff. It has to do with general citizens in this country being irresponsible, not taking responsibility for, the, for their responsibilities. And it has to do with being a lousy dog owner. Okay, honey, we're going to do the best we can by you. Okay, baby doll? I know, honey. I know these people are going to try to help you out. Sure they are. Okay. Buck Sweetheart, Southern Indiana Rescue Effort out. Please, for God's sake, save this little boy, okay? This is not a joke. It's his life that's on the line. Bye, Buck.